it's Sophie and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is a very classic video, it's a skincare and makeup haul. Last week was Black Friday and I broke the bank. I could have done more damage than I actually did, but I spent more than I would have liked to. But you just can't go wrong with Black Friday sales, so I thought I'd give you all a little haul. So here are the parcels that arrived. There is five and I'm going to sit and go through them. First we're going to start with Beauty Bay. I actually did this order a week before Black Friday, something like that because they started their sale early and the things I wanted, I was scared they were gonna sell out, so I got them just before. This is mostly skincare bits, so I'm just gonna quickly go through. There isn't too much. First of all, I got some Derma Planners. I needed some of these and the ones I get are really expensive and I think these were like from 10 to four pounds, something like that, so I thought they were really good, so I got them. I then got some Be Perfect 10 Second Strawberry Tanning Mousse. This I'm wearing now, it's a bit old and crusty this and all that, but it's gorgeous, the smell is unreal. I was a bit sceptical because it did say fast drying and I was like, mousses don't really tend to fast dry, but it genuinely did, like within the hour it was basically dry. So I just slept in this overnight and washed it off in the morning and it was gorgeous. The only thing, obviously it is 150ml rather than like a normal tanning bottle, so like 200 ml and it only lasts 3 to 5 days instead of 5 to 7 but it's cheaper than the rest and it's really good so I have no complaints about this. Next is just a top up of the Soothing Serum from By Beauty Bay's own like, skincare brand. I ran out of this the other day and I was like oh my god I need one. It was on sale which was perfect. Next up is this Super Jelly Cleansing Gel with Prebiotic and Avocado. Um, it's just a cleanser from Beauty Bay Skincare Range. I have loved my simple cleanser for years so I was really looking to get a new one. And this was on sale and I was like, you know what? The only thing is that the pump is funny and I actually read the reviews and the pump doesn't, it is dodgy. But just to let you know if you are going to get this, the pump is dodgy and the reviews do say that. Next we have this Soothe Paste Blemish Treatment um, from Beauty Bay Skincare again. It's just a spot treatment. I've used this a few times and it is really good. Lastly from Beauty Bay I got their clay mask. I've been using this, it's really good. It's huge, I think it was like six pound or four pounds something like that it's honestly huge um the only thing is it does tingle your skin when you first put it on and i read that in the reviews as well just to like let you know but it is really good it's just like a normal clay mask it is for oily normal and combination skin types it just says for refining and mattifying the skin so just basically a clay mask next we have the old beauty i didn't get this it was like a black friday but it wasn't in the sale they released um some more 10 pound mystery boxes which i missed out on the first time which i was so gutted about but I got my hands on one this time, and for what you get in it, it's so good just for £10. The packaging is so cute as well. I'm actually going to like keep the, I keep packaging, like this and P. Louise packaging, I just keep all the time. I think it's actually the same for every single person. I think everyone gets, oh, <laughs> I think everyone gets two lashes and two lipsticks. Correct me if I'm wrong, I'm not too sure, but from what I've seen, everyone gets two lashes and two lipsticks. So the lashes I got were the DBO9. These are gorgeous. These are more of a natural style. You see that? And then DBO8. This is more of a fuller style and they kind of wing out, have that gradient. Just like that. They are gorgeous. The two lipsticks I got were Get Lippy and Double Booked. Now I actually already have Double Booked. It was a gamble. Like if you have a lot of dull beauty products, you don't want to get doubles. It is a real big gamble. But I'm actually going to just put this in my giveaway box. And this Get Lippy apparently is everyone's favourite shade. So I'm super excited. I'm actually going to open this. I haven't seen it yet. I haven't actually opened it. It's like the perfect nude. Oh my god, let me show you. Can you see that? Like Wow. How gorgeous, I can't wait to use that. I love Dull Beauty lipsticks. I'm wearing one now, I'm actually wearing Dolled Out and I've got the Be Perfect Starkers lip gloss on top. Just in case anyone wants to know the lip combo today. So that was all from Dull Beauty. Now from Be Perfect. I only actually got two things. They had a really good sale on, but I actually didn't need much from them. I got the Be Perfect Reflect and Perfect Handheld Mirror. This was reduced, I'm not sure what the starting price was, but it was reduced to £7.98 I think. Yeah, £7.98 which was so good. I've used it already so it's a bit dirty. I'm really sorry. I cannot keep stuff clean. The next thing from Be Perfect was a Persian Gold Face and Body Glow. This is in the shade Ari. This is their collaboration with Mars The Label. I'm wearing this now. Can you see that glow? I really hope you can. I don't tend to use body and face glows. However, with a tan, this just looks unreal this was i think 20 pound or 18 pound it was reduced down to 10 which was such a bargain i was like oh my god i have to get it this is the middle shade as well 
now for the bit I think everyone's been waiting for, my P. Louise haul. These were the things that I was most excited about. I'm going to start with what I actually got on Black Friday because that holidays deal box, I actually got a few days before Black Friday, but it wasn't in the Black Friday sale, so it didn't really matter. I'm just going to go through my little package of what I got actually in the Black Friday sale. I'm like, is there something still in there? Yeah. <laughs> All bases were reduced to £5 from £10, which was an insane deal. It was 50% off. I topped up on three. I got the uh, Rumour 3, which I've got on my eyes now as a base. It's just for when I tan. I got a new Rumour Zero. I love this. I love mixing it with other bases. I've got to make lighter shades. Um, and I've run out of this completely. So, yeah, I need to do one of them. And then I got Room Up 7. Now I'm hoping to try this as a cream contour. I don't know how it's going to work, but I do like using the other bases on my skin. So I'm hoping this will be perfect for cream contour. I wasn't planning on getting any more coloured bases. However, I saw these two. So these are the basic, I think they're pastel ones. Uh, this is pretty in pink and this is cute in coral. Um, I'm actually going to swatch them for you so you can see. But P. Louise herself uses both of these as a blush. And I've actually got both of them on today as a blush. And I'm obsessed. Like, I literally love them. I love cream blushes at the moment. I love the P. Louise OTT Orange for a blush. However, it is so bright. So these are just the perfect, like, pastel shades. This shade here is cute in coral. And this shade here is pretty in pink. As you can see, they are the most beautiful pastel colours. And together, they make such a gorgeous combo as well. These were £5. And usually they're £10. They were 50% off as well. Then I also got my hands on three of the Acid Rain paints in collaboration with Mimi Mitchell. I got the shades Raver, Ecstasy and Glow Girl. The only one I didn't get was the lavender one. I got Nitro in my holidays deal, which I'll go through in a minute. So I'm going to show you what the shades look like. This shade here is the shade Raver. Gorgeous, gorgeous, like hot pink. This shade here is called Glow Girl. So it's kind of a darker pink with a tiny hint of purple as well, but it's stunning. This last shade is Ecstasy. It is this gorgeous, gorgeous dark purple. I'm so excited to use this shade. These were all reduced to, I think, £4.35, which was such a good bargain because that is like over £10 off or £10 off, which was insane. So that was all that I got in the actual Black Friday sale. However, a couple of days before, I got the Holidays box. I got this just because I kind of wanted to treat myself. I did so much overtime in november i thought you know what i'm going to treat myself i paid 60 pound i also got free shipping which was great if you add all the products up it comes to about 115 pound so you save about 50 pound which is really really good the cutest packaging as well you've probably seen this in the back of my previous videos just because i thought it looked really cute so you open it up you get this cute little tag and it says santa baby all i want this year is p louise ho 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 and then on the back it says Dear the baddest babe, happy holidays, love from. So if you was giving it to someone, you could write it on there. It comes with a sticker that I could not keep intact, I'm afraid. Um, and the paper says stuff like blizzard babe, if kisses were snowflakes, just cute stuff. We open it like so, and you get all of this for £60, which is incredible. I'm just going to pop it on my lap, and then we're just going to go through what you get in it. First of all, you get a Rumour 2 base. It's just the standard 15ml base with a 7071 devoted to my base. So obviously this is for patting on the eyeshadow base. I haven't tried any of P. Louise's brushes before, so I'm really excited to get this one and an form. You then get the discontinued hollow gloss. This is stunning. The shade of this is incredible. It's the perfect nude and it's such a gorgeous gloss as well. It is just stunning. It is the perfect nude shade. Then you get to choose one acid rain paint. You could choose in any one. I chose Nitro. This is the one I wanted to try the most. And then obviously the others are just in the cell. Such a good deal that I got them. It's more like a teal colour. I thought it was a green. But it is more of a teal. It has kind of a blue in it. Then you get to choose three pastel bases. I got the shades Yummy Yellow, Winter Rose and Summer Blues. I wanted Winter Rose to use as a pink blush which i have done in it is gorgeous then i wanted yummy yellow and summer blues just because i have the red one of the bright and i thought if i have all primary colors i can make any color that i want and to then lighten it if i needed to i have the white base then you get a crisp finish base this is in the shade smoky and hot gorgeous gorgeous color rebecca cable says it looks unreal in the waterline so i'm really excited to try this i kept the packaging intact as well when i opened it i literally have just cut open the bottom so if you want to keep your packaging intact just 
cut open the bottom of it and everything will come out. I didn't actually know, but you do get a brush with, when you buy the crisp finish paints. And I just assumed that in this box you'd just get the base, but you actually get the brush as well, which is really cute. And the packaging on that brush is gorgeous as well. The shade is kind of like a burnt orange. I'm not too sure what drew me to get this shade. The others weren't like calling my name as much as this one. And lastly, I am so excited for this one. It is the Brow Gel and Brow Pencil Duo. This is the shade Mochaccino. This is the middle shade. So there's three shades, the second one. It's literally just like a coffee cup. <laughs> So you get the brow pencil and a brow gel. This brow gel is huge. I haven't actually tried this yet just because I prefer using my pink honey. The, the colour is perfect, just like a normal spoolie as well. And then the brow pencil, oh, I've been using this and it's been unreal. <laughs> it is so fine, which is what I need and love in a pencil. Look how thin that line is. The end of it is so tiny, which is so, so great for doing your brows. And obviously at the other end it just comes with a normal spoolie. It is honestly the perfect Christmas present. You have everything you need as like a P. Louise starter kit. So that is the end of the video. I love watching hauls myself so I really hope you enjoyed watching. I thought it was kind of a perfect way to show you everything I got for Black Friday but also give anyone any ideas for Christmas presents. If you did like the video please give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on so you get a notification every time I upload a new video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.